Hey, how'd the taping go? I don't want to talk about it. Oh, sorry. No, it's, it's fine. No, it's not. You know what? I should get that hotel room. No, 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 no. We want you here. Seriously. Obviously, you and Brad need some alone time together. Somebody is sleeping on the couch and you're fighting at work. Yeah, well, what happened at the studio has nothing to do with you. Oh, yes, it does. I'm a big part of that. I asked Jack to do something that he didn't think was right. And I helped Bradley destroy evidence. We all made mistakes here, Janet. Well, the only mistake Jack made was caring too much about all of us. You know, he really is a great guy. I know, he is. Are you okay? You're crying. I don't know. I really should be laughing because when you think about it, it's really pretty darn funny. What is? <laughs> Jack can't stand people who are dishonest. And yet he can't be honest with himself. About what? Carly. <laughs> He's always gonna have feelings for her, isn't he? The thing is, Jack and Carly, this thing that they have, it's, it's kind of impossible for anyone to come between. Better women than me have tried. No, right? no, it's not about better or trying, it just is. Well, at least I could say that I did the right thing. I left. Because I know that Jack is too polite to kick a girl to the curb. Yeah, but it would hurt a lot less if you did. At least then you could be angry about it. I know, it is so much easier to be angry than sad, isn't it? I know, I've been realizing that lately. I would much rather be angry any day. Hey. Go in the other room. I was thinking about what you said, and you're right. I haven't tried hard enough to make up for what I did, so I was hoping that you could help me figure out how to fix that. What's that? Might have caught ourselves a break. There's a chance that this is the beach cottage where Stenbeck's holding Meg. Where is it? Well, we did a little research, and we think based on the swans and the sign, it's a place called Swan Island off the coast of Maine. How'd you find out about this place? What? Well, don't ask. But, uh, but you think it's reliable? Hey, listen, it's all we got right now, so run with it and see what you come up with. All right, look, I'll fax over to some of the precincts in Maine, and I'll see if anyone can recognize the property. Thank you. Right. Well, I, I hope this pans out for you. I know how worried you are about Meg. Mm, thank you. Thank you for your work today. I appreciate it. Hey, where are you going? Um, home, I guess. Let me give you a ride. Consider it an artist's fee. You haven't looked up from that thing since Jack and Carly left. You've got yeah, to give stop. it a rest, okay? Honey, you're running yourself ragged. No, look, I'm not going to stop until I get Meg back. Until I, I get her away from James. I think you should give Jack a chance. I think he can find them. How much of a chance am I supposed to give him? This is my wife and my child I know you don't want to hear this. You're right, I don't want to hear about this. You need to get out. I'm trying to help you. You're not helping. Get out. Leave me alone, James. Meg, it's going to be several months before that baby is born, and we're going to be here together, so why don't we try to find some way to get along with each other, all right? Yeah, well, I won't count on that happening anytime soon. Well, I hope you change your mind. What are you doing? I've got to go get some things. You're leaving? Yeah. But I'll be back. And when I come back, I expect to find you right here. Well, where else would I go? Right. I mean, you can't go running around out there. You may fall, hurt yourself, and there's no one to help you. Just go.
to do, Brad? Yes, you can. If there's anyone who could tell me how to make this right, it's you. But then I will be making it right, not you. I just want to make you happy. I'm not the one you have to make amends to. You owe your freedom to a lot of people, people who did things, made sacrifices so that you could stay out of jail. And I'm grateful that I, I really am. Well, then stop telling me what you think I want to hear and do something about it. Ah, oh, finally we are alone. Yeah. <laughs> oh, well, well. oh, oh, you're still in pain after the explosion, aren't you? Mm, only from the head down, sweetie. Oh, I'm so sorry I doubted you, Henry. No, oh, it's okay. No, it's not. I should have known that you'd never start gambling again, and I, I should have gone to the police instead of trusting Derek to find you. I was such a fool. No, shh, you are not a fool. You are the most amazing woman I have ever met, and I'm... I'm so lucky that you're mine. No, no, I'm the lucky one. I missed you so much. Oh, sorry. Yeah. No, don't be. No. No, don't stop. Agony has never felt like such ecstasy. Oh, yeah. Bonnie, can I join you? You're a free man. You can do whatever you want. Here, I owe you a pretty big thank you. you really put yourself out on the line for me. Yep, I was just doing my job. Is that what I am? Just a former client now? Yeah, I hope so. I see. No, I mean, I, I would hate for you to get in any more legal trouble. Does that mean you might consider seeing me again under different circumstances? I don't know. See. Would you like to come in? I should probably head back to the station. See if Dallas made any headway out in Maine. Yeah, right, of course. If he has, he owes it all to you. A big difference, Carly. Mm, yes, using my incredible powers for good. For <laughs> We still make a pretty decent team, you and me. Sometimes. I should, uh, I should go. Hey, G man. Be careful out there. Always. That was just a dream. That was a dream. That wasn't. That wasn't a vision. That was just a dream. As the world turns. I knew that I was wrong to sleep with Holden. Why does he get a free pass? Well, I'm supposed to wear a scarlet letter for the rest of my life. Holden, if we're gonna make love, I want it to be about me, not Carly. You're 
dead. Not unless you are. Where is she? Who? Meg! I have no idea! You're alive! 